you have the ability to look away from this. But they don't. They can't put this behind them. Because thanks to Yellen, they are behind bars, locked away, for a meat festival that will soon be happening. 10,000, 10,000 dogs and cats are about to be slaughtered, burned, skinned alive, electrocuted, just so that people can eat them. This is my dog, Ginger. She wasn't just a dog, she was my best friend. She was always there for me when I needed her. When I was sick, she would lay on my stomach to offer me comfort. When I had a bad day and was crying, she would sit beside me. She felt what we would feel. She would be happy every time we asked her if she wanted to go bye-bye because she knew she was going on a road trip and would get excited. She felt sad when she was sick. She would lay down because she didn't want to get up, just like we do when we're sick. And sometimes she would even whine in her sleep because she had a nightmare that scared her. She wasn't just a dog. She was my family. And right now, her family need us more than ever. When we tell them to sit, they sit. But now we need to stand. When we tell them to speak, they speak. But now we need to speak. Man is dog's best friend. But let's now show that dog is man's best friend. Speak. Act. Sign the petition. Not because it's the right thing to do, but because it's the human thing to do. These animals have done nothing wrong but been born into a society where it's okay to be cruel, sadistic, and heartless. But now it's time we put an end to that, once and for all. I'm raising my paw on behalf of my dog. I'm taking a stand. I'm speaking up. Will you?